Hello everyone, and welcome back to Flying Princess Plays Final Fantasy IX. Okay, so last episode, uh, Garnet lost her voice, and now she won't talk because she's, like, really depressed that her kingdom, you know, got smashed to you know, smithereens. And it was, it's really sad. Also, um, uh, Sid is no longer an Oglop. He is a frog now. And, um, now we're here at... Uh, Black Mage Village, I walked around too much. And we're going to ask them what their friends are doing with Kuja because they're in cahoots with Kuja now. Now I'm gonna kick this guy's ass and they're gonna go to Black Mage Village. See you there. Okay. Looks like nobody's here. Where'd they go? I'm gonna go look around. Where is everyone? They went away with Kuja. Two other guys stay behind. They're probably at the Chocobo Shack. Why? Why'd they go with him? They learned about our lifespan. We can only live for a given amount of time. Kuja said he knew how to extend our lifespans. So everyone followed him. Ah, oh, <sighs> idiots. He's obviously lying. He's lying! I bet he's lying! Look at what he's done to us. He's been using us, treating us like puppets. Maybe we are just puppets, created to serve humans. No, 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 no. Come on, that's nonsense. Where did they go? I can't tell you that. I can't betray them. Then why didn't you go with them? You said the two other guys are in the Chocobo Shack, right? Wow, dude. Vivi! Wow, you just ignore that cute little black mage. Fuck you, dude. Ah, huh, you're really not gonna say anything. <laughs> what? <laughs> Screw you. Hello, is anyone there? Vivi. Please, open the door! It's born! Oh. Wait! Oh, born? Oh, shit! <gasps> oh, it's adorable! Finally! Finally! Hooray! Hooray! I still can't believe it! Yeah! I don't understand. Why are you here? We're here to look after the Chocobo. At first we were going to go with everyone, but someone had to stay behind to look after the Chocobo egg, so we stayed. We kept the egg nice and warm by putting a lot of hay over it. I can't wait to show him to everyone. They're gonna be so happy. We have to come up with a name. Hey, what's happening to me? I feel strange. M me too. Oh. You stay behind because you were worried about the chocobo egg. I don't know. I wanted to follow Kuja because I was scared of dying. But I couldn't. I felt like I was leaving something important behind. I want to ask you something. What is it? A am I gonna stop pretty soon too? Oh! Oh, Zion doesn't like that. I don't know. Kuja said the prototype built before us would last longer. But... I am gonna stop eventually. I was really confused when my grandpa died. He told me, Vivi, no need to be sad. So, I told myself, I can't be sad. That's why I felt confused again when I heard that everyone was stopping around here. I didn't know what to do or what to feel. But when I saw Bayonette crying when her mom died, 
I wasn't confused anymore. I was sad. If I were just a puppet, I never would have felt that way. Mr. 288, we aren't puppets. I know we aren't. I hate him. I hate Kuja! He's turning everyone into puppets just to kill people. If it weren't for him, I know everyone would understand someday. It's not fair. Vivi. Kuja's secret place is in the eastern side of this continent. Oh, we got him. We got him, guys. He spilled. It's buried under quicksand. You only need a ship to get there. Thanks. I hope we can become strong like you someday. If he has so much on his mind. Unlike me, he's fighting so hard. I thought I would change after I met Zidane. Once I ascended to the throne, I knew I had to change. But nothing has changed. I'm so helpless. No. Wow. Ben, that were you listening to? That cry to be sure has come a long way, don't you think? Bayonet? Are you alright? Don't worry too much. Vivi has his own way of dealing with things and you have yours. Come on, cheer up. We'll beat Kuja and you'll get your voice back in no time. Siding. Is something wrong? Okay, let's get going. Mr. 288 said Kucha's palace is buried under quicksand, right? Yeah. We're taking the ship to the eastern side of the continent to get there. Okay, we're in the area and I think it's this one? Let's see. Uh, I think, yeah it is. <sighs> I knew you'd come. Everything is going according to plan. Siding! Rush, wake up! Ugh. Sid, where the heck are we? Good question. I wish I knew. After I fell into the quicksand, everything went dark. That's all I can remember. Me too, Robert. When I woke up, Robert, I was in this room. Oh yeah, where is everyone? I don't know, Ribbit. I hope they're all right. So, you're finally awake. That voice. It's Kuja. I'm so happy to see you again. You rat bastard. Where are my friends? My, my. Aren't we feisty today? No need to worry about them. They're in rooms not unlike yours. Oh, yes. By the way, I should probably enlighten you as to your current situation. The ice! Oh, shit. I'm sure that even your feeble mind can grasp what would happen if you were to take that plunge. <laughs> Kuja, you're dead! Oh, dear. Was it something I said? This guy! Got this guy! This. Ugh, fuck him. Either way, now that you're aware of your predicament, I'd like you to do a tiny little favor for me. Uh-huh, yeah? I'll let your friends live if you say yes. Ah, uh, no choice. Damn it. I don't have a choice. Very good. You've chosen wisely. First, step outside. Hey, Sid, I need you to look after the others. Fine, Robert. I won't let you down. And you, Robert, you come back safe. Yeah, I will. See ya. Okay. 
Not these guys again. Stay between the two black mages. Welcome to my humble abode. Oh, jeez, this uh, this place actually looks pretty dope. Just cut to the chase and tell me what the hell you want. My, we're upset, aren't we? Well, this is your errand. I want you to go somewhere and bring something back for me. So tell me, what is it already, you demon? I'd watch my mouth if I were you. Surely you haven't forgotten that I hold your friend's lives in my hands. I'm going to send you to a place called Olivert. Where's that? Olivert is south of the Seaways Canyon on the Forgotten Continent. It really isn't my kind of place. What do you mean by that? You see, there's an anti-magic barrier around the place. And I don't want to send you because you're too stupid to use magic. Once there, I want you to retrieve the Gulag Stone for me. What do you say? Isn't it a simple task? Oh yeah, sounds real simple. I'll even send you on my luxury cruise ship, so you won't have to worry about transportation. Perhaps it's too much for you. I'd better send you with three of your friends just to be safe. Besides, nobody likes to fight against himself. <laughs> Never mind. Speak their names when you've chosen your partners. Okay, I choose... These three. All right. I want Freya, Amaranth, and Bayonet. Fine, I shall summon them. Freya. Amaranth. And bayonet. Step through the door. All right. Proceed to the center of the platform. Spare the emotional reunion scene, please. Now go stand with your friends. You better keep your promise, Kuja. Of course, you needn't worry one bit. <laughs> what a bunch of idiots. Wow. Now, you guys are probably thinking, why choose Bayonet? Isn't she a magic user? Yeah, well, I choose Bayonet for this part all the time because, well, I have her healer ability on. So that, yeah, she can't use cure or anything like that, but she can still use healer and she can, like, hit people with her wand and all that stuff. So anyway, yeah, it's all good. I'm good. Okay. Whoa! Yeah, it's pretty big. Jeez. That must be the Hildegard 1. Let's get on it! Alright, let's go. I guess it's uh, so nice to have autopilot on. I'm not doing anything here. Just keep on coming there.
Hey, can we really trust Kucha? <laughs> wow. Hey, can we really trust Kucha? Hey, say something! Ah, They will not answer to you! Respond to your orders only, they do! Why, you backstabbing bozos! Those are slanderous words! Worst lies I've ever heard! You need to concern yourself with such things! Or to an end your friend's lies we shall bring! Damn it! Wow, they'd love to play that, uh, we're gonna kill your friend's trump card, don't they? The black mages were originally designed just to oppress. But as the straw sense itself, the black waltz has come to possess. Always obey us, these mages do, because a strong ego they have not. Oh, dude. These mass-produced ones are to break once we are through with their lot. Other purpose than war, they have not. Aw, oh, screw you guys. They have grown attached to life, yet they'll soon disappear! Hilarious! Nothing but toys they are! They're here. I don't think you guys are any different. What?! Rubbish! You say that the Black Mages have no souls, but you guys are pawns just like them! Oh, truth! Am I right or what? You won't be talking so big once we're done with you! Regret those words, you will! Well, let's just take it easy until we arrive. Drive safe, all right? Ah uh, ha ha, he just told both of you. Ah, we're here! And of course, they park way too far away. Wow. <laughs> now we're gonna just have to walk the rest of the way. Great. Thanks for nothing. Okay, we're here. Oliver. Alright. Destiny. It's so unusual to have visitors here. Please let me know for me, Kubel. Ah, okay. Thanks, Kubel! This is through the entrance. Mm. Open up! No way I can open a door this big. Whoa! <laughs> no need. I don't know what's going on, but I guess we gotta go inside. It's an honor to be here. <laughs> okay, this place is not creepy at all. <laughs> Oh, hey, it's Stilsk, everybody! Hey, Stilsk! Okay... Yeah, sure. Thanks to you, kid, now I can continue my journey. Right. Oh, hey, you're the guy I need to deliver the mail for! I got... The, the person who wanted me to deliver this to you is, like, right outside. He could easily just come in here and get it to you himself. What a lazy asshole. Thanks for delivering the letter from Melissa! Artemision hasn't been delivering mail lately. Let's read, Kubo. I haven't received any mail lately, Kubo. What's going on? Hey, Mua, would you go to the Monkle Central and complain for me? I'm so mad about it, Kubo. Oh, Artemision isn't doing his job. Mimosa is scary when she gets mad. I'm not sure where Magnet Central is, though. Neither do I. I'll give you this in exchange for delivery. Oh, thanks. I don't know who to get that to when, uh, when we get out of here, finally. <laughs> What's this weird ceiling thing? Strange pattern on the floor. It's gotta have another purpose than just lighting. Looks like the door is sealed. No way I can open it. Ooh, what's this? 
Ok. Whoa, that's what it did. Okay. Is this a planet? That looks like writing. The likes of which I've never seen. Mother. Terra. Ah, oh, I can't make it out. Ha! Huh, you only wish you could read it. It's not that I can read it. It's more like the words are talking to me. I don't even know why. Man, did you listen to Amaranth? He's so jealous that I can read something that he can't. <sighs> Poor soul. Maybe he's still listening now. Let's see. Nope. Nada. Okay, now there's a certain order though, I know. Yeah, yeah, proper order. Maybe it's the first one. Ah, yes. Aha! It worked. Ancient ship. Oldest in history. I knew you just had to do it in the right order. Alright. Now this one, I think. The ship for war. Shipbuilding technology primitive. Battleship. Invincible. Prototype. Prototype. Failure. The first battleship. Invincible. Improved version. Currently in use. Maybe this will work now. Oh, yep. Yeah, well, it's shining. Shining bright. Huh? It's gone. Whoa! Beginning of the city. Huh? Now it's gone again. Whoa! At first, the city flourished. Soon, began to decline. At its peak, cities all over Terra. Then, the decline began. All these secrets! So what the heck is all this? Oh, it's Queena! Yeah, I know that it's not Queena because I have a way better weapon on her. This might be a little bit overboard, but why not? For anyone who doesn't like Queena, they should play, they should, you know, pay close attention to this. Holy shit. <laughs> All right, finally open. What is this place? A strange room this is. The faces disturb me. Oh shit. What is your problem, punk? Wait, uh, it's, it's saying something. Visitors, climb atop the stone. Huh? I guess it's speaking directly into our minds. Well, let's go. Ugh. Ah, personally, I wouldn't, but, you know. <laughs> you have to, I guess. Visitors, listen well. This is the record of our civilization. 
The sea's decline was not our fault. All vegetation and vessels died out. The decay of our terror triggered it all. In order to stop decay, many methods were considered. Ultimately, the best minds of Terra civilization gathered. Then a final resuscitation was attempted on the Mother Continent. Unfortunately, it ended in failure. It was later discovered to have been catalyst. Subjects were selected. Oh, that one has a creepy face. I don't like that face. After four tremendous sacrifices, eternal prosperity seemed within reach. Flora and fauna were revived, but still stasis. Final results are still pending. In order that our glorious history did not die with us, we were constructed. Okay. What could this mean? Only Ziding is able to comprehend these runes. Ooh. I want no two, but our friends are in danger. So let's save them first. Hmm. It looks different than before. It looks like that other planet. Wh what's this? Another planet? Oh shit! What the heck could this mean? Now I know there's a boss down here, so I'm just getting all pumped and ready for him. So this is what Kuja was harping about. Time to head back. Whoa! Something's coming! Oh, here we go! All right. It's like a giant ship monster. It's pretty funny. Here we go. All right. Wow, he's got pretty good attacks. So I'll give him that. Okay, time for trance. You know what? I, I like it's really funny. I think the Amaret looks like a porcupine in trance mode. <laughs> okay, I got Freya in trance. All's well in the world. Whoa, jeez. Okay, this is not good. Everyone's totally confused. Come on, hurry up and jump, Freya. You're almost out of trance. That's right, fly Freya! Finally she can do her jump in trance. You have no idea how long it took her to do this. Oh, 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 we got him guys! We got him! He's lowered down, he's dead. Do, 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 do. Fuck that thing. All right, let's get it now. <laughs> we gotta get back to the others. Why am I trapped in here? Hey, someone let me out! This is no way to treat a lady! Aww. I hope Zion and the others are alright. I'm sure they'll come back for me. 
So, how do you like the special sweets I reserved for each of you? By the way, Ziding is out running an errand for me in return for your safety. But I hate keeping promises. And I so love deceit. So I thought I would give you a special debt to remember me by. This asshole, this lying prick. But you know, you shouldn't really suspect anything else from this guy. My palace is home to a magnificent hourglass. As its sands fall, the floors of your room slowly open. Well, isn't it a fabulous idea? Your lives will be spared. The hourglass is reset. Its hiding comes back in time, that is. Oops, just ten more minutes. Better start praying. Farewell, my sweet little morons. <laughs> What? Somebody help me! Farewell, my sweet little morons. <laughs> that bastard Kuja. That does it, Robert. If I don't save them, no one will. We got to save him. Go, you brave, brave frog. Say. I reset the hourglass and locked it just because I was ordered to. What we're doing is wrong, isn't it? Wait, isn't that better than to stop functioning? No. Have morals, guys. Seriously. C come on, let's go back. Turning off that trap again? I still don't understand how you do it. You basically have to turn them all on. You're just thinking too hard. Let's go. Hey, I'm Sid. Happy, 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 happy. That must be the key they were talking about. Okay. Oh right, yeah. Okay, too soon. Right, I have to sneak by this guy. I guess I should stand still when a creature looks this way. But you know, you don't really have to. I mean, he's in a cage. You know, it's not that bad. Okay. Concentrating. Major slow mo. And that guy looks back. Does he think that I'm like a statue or something? Being physically still like that? Yeah, I already know what to do, so let's, um... Oh, wait, do I have to examine them first? Yeah, yeah, no. Okay, yeah. I know what to do. I think it's just, like... Uh, is it this one? Right? Please work.
if I remember. Hopefully I did it right. Okay, I think that's it. Gotcha! Just have to turn this upside down, Robert. Aha, sabotage! Now everyone should be alright. I thought I was a goner! Thank goodness we made it! Aha, you all made it! Huh? You saved us? I'm doing puts in JC, mind you. But we've no time to celebrate, Rabbit. I heard from two black mages, Rabbit, that there's some kind of trouble ahead. They said you basically just have to turn them all on. Whatever that means, Rabbit. But sorry. That's right, we can't just rely on Zidane. We have to work together until Zidane gets back. We can do it if we stick together. Oh yeah, wow, this place is nice. Well, we had a long, we had a nice go. Uh, I'm gonna stop things here now that I'm Eco. We're gonna go and start from being Eco next episode. So if you like what you saw here, you can set to me. You can also see my other Let's Plays. And I also have a playlist of the other times I played this game so you can see all the past episodes of all of them. All the else stuff, whatever. Okay, uh, bye everybody!